here at the Red Mile for Word on the Street for Late Night at the Plaza Sports. If you had the Stanley Cup for one day, what would you do? I'd drink beer right out of it and whiskey. Whiskey and beer. I'd jerk off in it! Uh, I would eat Fruit Loops out of it. I would sell it. I would sell the Stanley Cup. <laughs> worth I would a lot sell of money. the Stanley Cup. Yeah, well, it broke. So, like, I, I would give it to, um, to my friends. If it's a charitable thing. Is that a charitable thing? It's a terrible yeah. thing to do. It's a nice thing to do. <laughs> I thought you said terrible. But it's charitable. weird because terrible and charitable is kind of sound the same way. I would put it in the middle of the ocean and sink it to the bottom because fuck. Probably make a, a light out of it and just hang it above my dining room table. I'd probably jerk off into it a little. I'd probably smoke some weed with it because it's tight. Weed is tight. <laughs> Fuck her in the pussy! <laughs> I would raise it over my head and scream, We number one! <laughs> Teabag it, definitely. To eat ice cream out of it. I'd probably just try to get as many women as possible. It's a chick magnet. Chick magnet! Yo, 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 what's good? Act like a man and pee in it. You got any crazy sports locker room stories growing up or anything along those lines? You know I love that you asked me that question. You know I love that you asked me this question because like I, re I used to swim a lot. I used to swim a lot and like what I noticed is that I used to I used to swim and so I saw a lot of dicks. Yeah. One time my dad came into the locker room and uh, yeah, end of story. It's a competition of everybody jerking off around the bread and if the last person to, to, to finish the last person to finish jerking off on this piece of bread has to eat the piece of bread after oh man this guy one time he took, he took the ball and I blocked it from him <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I got pants pretty hard in about in the sixth grade, you know. Fuck. <laughs> you call me small penis pizzazz for a little bit. You know how weird it is to see, like, you know what I mean, like, really hairy bodies. I realize now as a grown man, with a shaved ball, with a shaved dick, and a shaved head. Fuck her right in the pussy. Fuck her right in the pussy. Fucker in the pussy! And I would lay down beside you! Oh, we're getting the moon. We're getting the moon. Uh, and what do you think of our new NDP government? Where were you guys like fucking six years ago when we all could have had fucking free university? Oh my god. Everybody educated feels really embarrassed about Ed Alberta right now. Kind of, sort of. Fuck the NDP! The new Fuck NDP government, NDP. I, I'm, uh, you know what, I'm uninformed, I'm going to say that. Uh, I'm a new Calgarian here, I'm from Toronto. I, uh, I respect the, the, the new NDP government um, from, what I've, from what I've learned, but I don't have a strong opinion that I could... Uh, Transfer to you guys tonight. Hey, PC has been. I want a recount right now. No, the NDP is the future. Is it not? Yeah. Fuck the NDP. I'm excited. I think 40 years is too long for any government to be in power. <laughs> um, I think it's crazy that uh, some 21 year old got elected yoga. in, but yeah. Yoga. Whatever. We'll see what happens. It's yoga and the weed. That's what people <laughs> care about these days. I mean, I, I think corporate taxes should be raised, and I think that the middleman should deserve more than he gets. Go NDP. Last question for you. I love jazz. I love jazz. And lastly, a flame's taking this in seven. You know what? We're gonna get them in Anaheim at home where it hits hurt. Where it hit. We're gonna get them home. We're gonna hit them where it hurts at home. Calgary Flames are going for the cup this year, 110%. Go Flames, go!
you can make this thing the best game of our life. Flames in seven. Hey, yeah, they can. I also, I also. They can. It comes out next week. Hey, what's up? Keep the guns. Shoot. On fire. Fuck you right in the pussy. Isn't that exciting? Sorry. Thanks so much, ladies. You're so welcome, Street Sense, or whatever this is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nah. Really? I could think of. We didn't have jizz on a sandwich.